What's going on, y'all? We live again. Derrick Jackson here. For those of you tuning in for the very first time, I appreciate you stopping by. For those coming back, thank you. Good to see you again. Man, today I want to talk about something, and it's funny I've never talked about this because, hell, I wrote two entire fiction novels based on this premise, but um, I got a question from a young lady, and I've got this question before, gotten this question before. Can a man love two women at the exact same time? Her situation is this. She got a man, loves her, but he also says he still loves his his uh, child's mother. I try not to say baby mama because I don't know the, know the other woman. But they were together three years. He got a child um, by whatever. He says he still loves her, and that's only natural that he would still love her, being that they got a child together and they got history together. All right, so my answer is actually really simple to this question. A man can be in love with two women. Oh, sorry. Excuse me. Let me correct that. A man can love two women at the same time, but he ain't in love with either one of them. You know what I mean? And to understand what I mean by that, you got to understand the difference between love and being in love. Like when I think of love, I think of like the bare minimum basics of I don't want anything bad to happen to you. Now, I don't want to see you go broke. I don't want to see you fall ill. I don't want you to die. I don't want, you know, anything messed up to go on in your life. Nothing to happen to your kids or nothing like that. Like. That's what I mean by love. That's why I can say, you know, I love everybody because I don't. I look around and see people that I want to fail or fall off the face of the fucking earth. Well, you know, sans a couple people. But you get what I'm saying. You feel what I'm saying? So when you talk about in love, the difference is everything's all inclusive. In love means comes with uh, protection included. It comes with exclusivity included. It comes with respect included. It comes with honoring them. And, and, and regarding them to the highest degree behind their back or in their face included and it's just for one person as far as in that capacity you know what i mean like that's the difference between being in love with somebody and that has to be the new standard like we look at too many times we do this man we look at love somebody say oh i love you and it's like oh my god i don't know if it's the movies i don't know if it's the books i don't know if it's the music you know this whole i love you thing has become like the gold standard and it shouldn't be not for a relationship if you giving somebody your all then them just loving you shouldn't be enough there's a lot of people today that are divorced that will still swear to swear that they love each other you know what i'm saying but they hate each other's guts at the same time they can't stand each other anyway there are some people who killed somebody who's like i still love them i don't want that kind of love you know if that's love now I don't, I don't, all good all love ain't good love in that case you feel what I'm saying? But when somebody's in love with you, then it's only you. Ain't no past, uh, you know, whatever. They may love that person in a different capacity now, you know, strictly as, um, you know, my, my child's mother or my child's father or whatever the case may be. That's strictly what it would be. It wouldn't be anything in the same. You don't have to share somebody's love whenever they're in love with you, you know. But you can share just love. Like for family members, say again, um... You know, you may love one sister and love the other sister the exact same way. You got two kids. You love both of them the exact same way. You got two parents. You love both of them the exact same way. It's not exclusive to either one of them. I got family I love, but I don't really fuck with too tough. But I love them because I don't want nothing bad to happen to them. But when it comes to a woman that I'm in love with, damn my exes, damn uh, a, a child's mother or, you know, Mother Teresa, I don't give a fuck who who she is. She's not getting the same love that I'm giving my woman because I'm in love with my woman. And that's the way men work. I don't know what you've been told. I don't know what you heard. But if a man is in love with you, it's you and only you. But I will say this. If a man loves you and he, know, and he loves a, another woman the exact same way, you're getting screwed over. Especially if you're giving him your all. So, take that how you want to, man. Peace.